super nature world. It's a world of incredible nature. Here we have a periplaneta. Um, this is the Australian cockroach. And it's seen better days. Poor little fella. Both antennas are quite short and it wasn't able to find food very well before, but it looks like it's just found something to snack on. Um, I just uh, sprinkled in some cockroach food, sweet potato chip there. Um, and then I, because I sprinkled in the food, it got all over the roach, as you can see on its leg there, and it was on its face. So I dropped a couple of water droplets on it to clean, clean it off, and uh, it drank the water. Now it looks like it's able to eat, which is good. It's like, oh, this is all food. Oh, jackpot. I found this one outside sitting in the open, which usually isn't a good thing for them. So it's probably very close to end of life. But, uh, I might as well give it a bit of food and water, warmth. That's final days. After saying that, it'll probably go on to live for another 90 days or something. In which case I could probably transfer it into the, uh, the glass tank. They're quite a fancy looking roach. I don't actually see many of these inside. They're meant to be a pest. But not this one. But also got a blue cube down there, which is a Hydration cube. It's possible this little guy might be okay for a bit. Oh, you're missing one of you. Little mouth parts as well. Mm. One of your petty pulps.
What are you gonna do? There's no food out here. Whoa, what was that cool manoeuvre? You're a lot more twitchy than the um, common methana we get around here. There you go. I need to get the lid. Could be in the sink. Is that what you want? It's water. Surely. It's kind of impressive. and then it's off to bed. <laughs> 